When I heard about Animals Australia launching this campaign to stop battery hen cages, I really wanted to lend my support because um, it's something that I, I feel pretty strongly about and I think um, Australia would feel really strongly about if they, they knew what was really going on. If you're an animal lover like me, you'll be really happy to hear that in the UK, the last battery hen has just been freed from her cage, and that battery cages are now banned throughout the European Union. But our own government is refusing to act, and as I speak, 12 million beautiful hens are cruelly confined in Australia. It's up to us to set them free. Join me in refusing to buy cage eggs and help Animals Australia make the battery cage history. I don't think most people in Australia know that there are 12 million caged hens still left in Australia. I was certainly shocked to find out that, that figure. When I heard that the European Union had banned the battery hen cage, I was really thrilled that someone had set a precedent. Any life of any creature on earth that involves never seeing the outdoors until the very last day of their life is just, it's impossible to imagine supporting that kind of thing. And if we can avoid it, then I, I think that, you know, it's the least we can do. It's so sad that 12 million beautiful hens like Henrietta are still in battery cages today around Australia. Now that the European Union have, have banned battery hen cages, I think it's it's really time for Australia to step up and ban them as well because the quality of life of these hens is just is just horrendous and I don't think anybody wants to wants to contribute to that. People's buying choices is is a way of voting. It's it's um it's uh, the biggest power that the people have. If people were to stop buying cage eggs then the problem would be over. Like that's that's as simple as it gets.